Hello and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're going to show you what we got this week at the Goodwill Outlet Bins. Here, Here we, we go. go. <laughs> Hey, hello you all. Uh, I hope you're doing well. I am back from New Jersey. I know some of you had commented. If you haven't seen, uh, we've been traveling. Over here is my vlogging channel. And uh, Molly did not come with us uh, because she had to work. And Maddie had to work as well. So it was just the four of us. And uh, we are back now. They stayed and took care of the dogs and the plants. We did. I kept <laughs> them all alive, which is you big guys for did me. so great. Yeah, they I kill great everything that lives. Like plant wise, not animal wise. Not animals. No, no, no. I'm very good with animals. Yeah. So anyway, um, so now we're back and we went to the bins. We were gonna go garage selling this morning, but we had big thunderstorms, so that did not happen. Mm -mm. So Molly and I decided to go to the bins and we're gonna show you what we got. We're just gonna take turns, I think, yeah. right? If you could see the floor around us right There's now. A lot of stuff. It was a good day. We are at the bins. surrounded. Yeah. So Okay, I'll start with my stuff. Uh this is the first bit of vin vintage kitschy Christmas I have found of late. I, I don't know. I think they're supposed to be coasters, although I'm not entirely sure. They I like think someone they be, yeah. made them to be, I think, Christmas coasters. I don't know, but you know, they're plastic and kitschy and that's my thing. So I got those. Yeah. Okay. All right. So the first thing I'll show you, I got some of these. So I'm, okay. For those of you who aren't like as in tune with the fashion of the youths, um, the, the early, youths. the youths, the early 2000s and like later 90s my, my time. back in full swing. Yeah. So that style is like back in full swing. So if you're noticing some of that in my, uh, finds today, that's to be expected. Even like what I'm wearing right now, like yeah. my little like cropped button down mm -hmm. thing. So these oh, are that's rough hone, hewn, hewn, well-worn. So basically I found this one first and I was like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. For me, I'd probably wear it open with like a little brown tank top underneath because it's... It, is it flannel? Or no, no, it's, it's just cotton. like cotton. Oh, it's cute. very soft, but it's got these little like brown and blue flowers on it. And then I just kept finding them. So then oh. the next one I found was this one. Cute. So I got that one. That one's like got little pinky flowers on it. And then I also got this one and I really couldn't pick one. I knew I wanted the blue one, but I couldn't get rid of just one of them and since it was the bins it really doesn't matter that much because yeah. it's so cheap so if I don't wear all of them that's fine I know I'll wear the blue one and I have a feeling I'll wear this one I don't know how to wear this one just yet but yeah that's my idea with those so oh, and we should say I spent 30 bucks I spent 41 so I spent yeah more, but you I may or may not see everything yeah she doesn't know she's gonna show everything yeah. I'm just gonna go until she's done yeah so and that's the most I've spent at the bins in a while yeah um, same it hasn't been that good but for today me that's was a like good day. more like back to college stuff like I did yeah. get lots of stuff for fall and things like that so and she's going through her closet I know a lot of you you know ask these questions because we thrift stuff we use it for a little bit and mm -hmm. then we send it back well you figure you get a shirt for three dollars yeah. you don't have to wear it a thousand like you yeah. wear it three times it's like yep all right my next thing I want to show you oh my goodness so I picked these up holy cow they're so cute they are vintage ice skates little kid size and I got these because Chris and I like two years ago during garage sale season we had gotten a male of like a men's pair and a, a women's pair of ice skates and we hang them in our entryway at Christmas time you just put a little like Christmas greenery, maybe a ribbon, whatever. And so now I have a little kid pair to hang so with those, and I think that's they look just so old, adorable. They I can't imagine so those were comfortable, right? Like they, they look, look like bowling so uncomfortable. shoes, yeah, on ice skates. Like there's looks like no cushion. It's just yeah. like a plank and like yeah. leather. They are leather. I don't see a size or a name or any. Oh wait, hmm. looks like there was something. I can't read it. It's oh, worn out. But anyway, size three. three. Yeah. So super cute. Super cute okay all right the next thing i will show you i guess i'll show you well maybe i'll just do a couple mm -hmm. since it's just one this again okay well that's cute i don't know if this is gonna fit so this is a target dress it's wild fable thought it was so cute it's a large which i can wear but it's very short that's short dude but when you put it on it might not but it's very tight How about fitted. The leggings that's 90s bring in the trend we'll see 
We're Hide your see. booty. We're going to see what happens with this dress. She's 20. I really can't regulate what she wears anymore. Um, I can just offer my motherly I'll opinion. I'll determine <laughs> whether the length is modest enough or not. So that's that. Anyway. It's very cute. Yes. And then the other dress I will show you is this. This is a large too. See, This is cute. In dresses, I'm usually a medium. Um, so these could be a little big. Just around the waist. Um... But this one's just this little light pink, very like lightweight kind of, yeah. it's really like very like soft feeling, kind of shiny. Mm -hmm. So thought that was cute. I'm in a sorority at school, so I've got lots of opportunities to wear dresses and I just wear them for life. So yeah. yeah. Okay. And then I'll show you a few things. Uh, okay. I'll show you these two things. So this I got just cause you know, I collect old sifters. I really like them. I like so to hang cute. them. I can hang them on my... I have one of those uh, rods uh, oh, yeah. on the side of my island. I think that would be cute there. You could set it here on top of my cabin. It's not sure exactly where I'll put it yet, but it says two cups full, and they spelled it right, right? Because people today say two cupfuls, but it's really two cups full. Oh, I was like, wait, why yeah. did I spell it wrong? I understand. And this is how it works. So, full handle. Uh, so I got that, and then I got this. It's a little so mirrored uh, vanity tray. Whoa, Ooh, you there's our whole <laughs> house. <laughs> but um, I thought this was really pretty, and I'm going to put this on my grandmother's vanity. I think I've mentioned Maddie is um, moving out. She, she got is. an apartment, which was always the plan before the pandemic. pandemic. Mm. But she's moving out for September 1st, and so this will probably go on my grandmother's vanity once she is Moved out. It's so. going to be a mass exodus. <laughs> Everyone's leaving Because Gabe once. leaves, then Maddie leaves, <laughs> then I leaves. It's just wild. Just me, me. I need to learn how to cook differently. Like, I don't oh, know yeah. how to cook for, for like, three people. Okay, even me and Maddie, though. Like, when we were doing it by ourselves, I was like, how many noodles do you make for right, two people? Right, I was like, normally I just dump in two bags. So, and funny like, story. I did this week. I don't have it here. I got a cookbook that says cooking for two. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, I could just add a... I could, like, double that mm -hmm. and that would be cooking for four or something. You know, yeah. but at least, like... Shows me how to cook right nice things and we eat a decent amount, so amounts. yeah. So, anyway, all, all right. right, go on. Next, um, I think I'm gonna show them maybe this situation. Oh, I love that. So, as I said, I am shopping for fall, so I got this really cute corduroy Ooh, jacket. I love that with yeah, like this fuzzy kind of like fleecy stuff. I'm big about layering, especially Minnesota, because. You know, like you need your warm clothes outside, but then you get inside and it could be a zillion degrees and you're like, I can't or wear what I was wearing outside. Or you wake up and it's chilly. Mm -hmm. And then by the afternoon, it's, it's like warmer. warmer. So yeah, because sometimes you then, wake up, it's 40 degrees. Yeah, but then, and then as soon as 60, the sun goes down. Yeah, it's cold again. So layers are ideal, especially in our falls and early winters. That's a great so color. I, I would call it like butterscotch. Yeah, butterscotch I definitely say it's like water. butterscotch. So yeah, and uh, I don't know what size it is, but... I keep on. buying things, and I, they might be child sizes. This one's not. But, like, no, it'll be like, ones. oh, it's an extra large. And I'm like, well, that doesn't look like an extra large. Yeah. But anyway, so I got that. The other thing I got is this little, like, mint green, almost, like, light blue colored shirt. It's just very soft. Definitely, like, early 2000s kind of vibes. Yeah. But I thought it was cute. Very kind cute. Fun. Okay, I got something fun to resell. Uh, I looked them up online. Some of them are like $25. Some mm -hmm. of them are like 10 It depends on the one. But they're it's the bullseye, this, the dog from Target. They're so cute. And they're collectible. And they're from like 2007. I think most of them are from 2007. I got a ton of them. And this is cute. so I'm not sure if I'll sell these on eBay or at the shop. I haven't decided yet. I don't do a ton on eBay because, you know, I hate, I hate shipping things. But I do have an eBay account, which I don't give out, so please don't ask. Um, so I might sell these, or I might not. I don't really This know. one's a girl. Yeah, there's uh, different ones. That one's cute. She's cute. This is probably my favorite one, the one that has the name tag. Yeah, that one's cute. That's a Adorable. classic, like you walk into Target, that's yeah. what they look like. Very cute. So I got a bunch of those. Mm -hmm. Oh, here's another one. Oh, it has a life jacket. A life jacket. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many. They're really cute. This one, I like to, I like this one too. He's, yeah. he's looking spiffy. He looks like a, de like a car dealer or yeah, something. Yeah, for sure. The casino. All right, okay. Next, I got these. Brand is Pretty Little Thing, which I have heard of that brand before. They're just some sweats. Mm. They're very like. Trendy I feel right like now. I bought those for Hannah at quite a cost. 
Yeah, you probably did. Something very similar. Hannah has a pair just like these that were probably like $50. Yeah. I probably got mine for like mm, three maybe. Yeah. Probably less than even. that. No. Not even. Maybe a dollar. But yeah, so those I thought were cute. Those are large, so they could be a little big, but I'm not concerned. And then, I mean, some of the things might seem kind of boring, but I'll just show you because I got them. Oh, that's um, cute. Got this little cropped cream colored, like... I really like that. Not a sweatshirt, a crew neck. Yeah. Um, and I, okay, this one's um, a New Day, which is a Target brand, which I really like. Usually when you find the cream colored, like, sweatshirts and stuff, though, they're in terrible shape at the bins, like, they're stained. But this one, very, I don't, I don't know that it has really any stains. Yeah. So, it's looking nice. good. Maybe a little one up here, but you can barely see it. Very nice. Thanks. Okay, also for my reselling, I got some knickknacks i got this little guy i'm gonna do a fall shelf at my little shop at my uh booth at the shop and i thought he would be cute he's a planter he is uh, we'll try to clean him out but um i think that's so cute owls are pretty popular i like so owls true. but he i like white out like lighter owls this mm -hmm. isn't my style except for like halloween but I don't, I don't need it and then i thought these were great also i'm gonna put these at the shop it's a pair, Kitties. and this one has rhinestone eyes. Oh, it's the Siamese them. ones? Or I don't no? know, but they say Japan ceramics. Uh, the Viag sparkly Viago. eyes are my favorite. I can't really read it, but you can kind of see that. Right. Um, anyway, so I thought those were really cute, and they were wrapped really well, which is how they did not break. They were wrapped in this stuff together. So. That stuff. I'm going to wrap them up again. Sounds good. So. Seems legit. All right, keep going. All right, next. This was one of my favorite finds. This is one of the things, I think it's got to be a child XL, because no way this is a women's extra large, or like a youth. Yeah. Could be youth. Yeah, youth, because it looks like it would fit me perfectly, but it says extra large. So That's cute. this is just a Nike hoodie. It's super soft. Like, it does have a couple little stains on the front. I'm going to see if I can get them out, and if I can't, I'm really concerned. Yeah, so, yeah. Cute. Okay. I got some glassware, and they are back to charging 49 cents for the glassware, which is really nice. I thought I had another one. Maybe not. Okay. I thought you had so, another one, too. Right? Was it that thing? Maybe it's just this. Okay. So, I got this. It is Pyrex. It's in great shape. It's like this sun. It has one scratch here. I don't know if you can see it. But it doesn't look like they dishwashered it. It still has its, like, sheen. You know? It's not, like, dull. And it's, like, this daffodil or Are you sunflower not to color. It? No. Oh. Because mm -hmm. dishwashers, like, weren't a thing. Yeah, so they weren't true. really made to we'll make it through. Yeah. yeah. Um, so anyway, this will go to the shop because I don't really do Pyrex. But I thought that was great to find. And then this will also go to the shop. This is so that um, Spice of Life stuff. I have a teapot in my shop and a little uh, cheese cutter, I think. Le Perzil. She speaks Le some Le French. Le hmm. Don't know. Don't but know. anyway, um, is it French? It looks French. French. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, Le La, I mean, I don't know if they use that in other languages. That, yeah. That looks like French, but I don't know what it means, so I don't really know. So anyway, got this. So that'll go to the shop because uh, I like to collect it, but I don't keep it for myself. So it's just fun to find, though, because a lot of people like it. Um, so that'll go to the shop. And then this is the one that I use. That's so cute. Isn't that cute? Teeny so tiny. we have, um, like, probably, like, an 8-inch square yeah. one that we use all the time yeah, for vegetables. Broccoli. It's yeah. always broccoli. But my mother-in-law like has one like this, and I forget what she what do you up use in it. it for? I don't know. I'll have to like, ask her. But I got it because she... <laughs> She has one. I'm like, oh, so Grandma cute. has that. And she uses it all the time. And it goes with my other one. So And it's so cute. And it's so little. Little. I don't know. Like any like little amount of stuff that you need yeah. to stick in the microwave yeah. or whatever. So got that. And then I also got this, which is a soap dish. And I don't know if you remember, but a few weeks back, I had gotten a bar of soap from a vintage market that I went Minnesota to. Minnesota Nice one? Or yeah, the Minnesota, Minnesota Nice one. one. Yeah. And then at the, um, we went to another market and I got another bar of soap. And the bars of soap, I put it by my sink. So we have two sinks in our bathroom. It just lasts so much longer yeah, than liquid soap. And if yeah. you're the only one using it, who cares, right? right. So I have mine in um, a little dish that I got back in my wedding. We've had it forever. So that's where my soap went. And so I got this one to put uh, a okay. bar of soap for Chris at his sink. This way, um, then we don't have to refill the hand soaps. Yeah. In our no one really uses your bathroom that much. No, it's only it's really you guys. just us. Yeah. Ooh, I right. like what I'm seeing. I'm going to knock out a couple things now. So this one was one purchase I I'm love this. so excited about. It's a guest fleece. It just says guest on it. Is that for you or your man? Me? I love it. If you donate it, 
Give it to I me. Won't. Donate it to me. All right, I will. Because I really like that. Isn't I that nice, it. though? Yeah, it's cute. super soft, and Guess is a great brand, mm -hmm. so... Yeah, it looks vintage. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Mm -hmm. um, and then, again, with the layering... Cute. We've got this guy, which... On further review, it doesn't have an actual collar, which might be a little weird, so... That's totally 90s. Is it? That okay. was very popular in the 90s. All right, well, then maybe I'll keep it, but it's just mm -hmm. this, like... I don't even know. Is that brown? It looks it's black. like blue and gray cut. Kind of looks black to me. TBD. We're not really sure what color it is, yeah. but just nice for layering with some jeans. And then this one's again kind of similar to that. This one's LL Bean, which is really nice. A little bit more like fitted for me because I think this is a women's size. Usually I get the men's and they're really big, but I like some that are a little yeah smaller. So this one's really soft. LL Bean, super nice. All right. Okay, I got, I actually got this box. I'm going to put the box at the shop, too, because people really yeah, like vintage cute. boxes. Cool. And it's in really good shape. But in it, I have stored away some things I didn't want to break on the way home. So you heard about my disaster where one of my shelves fell over. So I'm restocking. A lot of stuff that broke was a lot of my glassware that um, sells pretty well and barware. Um, so I got these really cool, we were, we were debating, are they like... Uh, cordial glasses or are they like double shots we don't really know but they're very vintage looking sure. totally 70s i was gonna say they look very 70s yeah, yeah. so got two of those they'll be great Sweet. in someone's man cave oh, right yeah. mm -hmm. for sure um so i got those two things and i'll show you two other things i also got this vintage frame which is so cute I haven't decided That's if nice. i'll keep this or if i'll pass it, it along really but i thought it was really pretty and in really good shape People like vintage frames. Um, and then this was a good find. I got this candle. This is from Bath and Body Works. I just bought this candle. I'm pretty sure it was the Midnight Blue Citrus for Alec for $15. Alec is her boyfriend, if yes, you sorry. remember. Yes, that's my boyfriend. Mm -hmm. And it was like 15 bucks. Yeah, and it's it looks a great like someone scent. lit it once. Burn it once, maybe and twice. Yeah, that was I it. it again. It's like an orangey. Oh, it's good. Oh, it smells so it's good. It's like a deep citrus. Like, it's yeah. like citrusy but it's got a little bit it's of not like, like lemon it's more yeah it it's almost. nice yeah. it's really nice and of course you know i'm switching some things to blue mm -hmm. for the fall true, so i thought true, that would be true. really pretty um in my decor as well as smelling good one of the things i'm really excited about brown is very in style right now like just like, like brown brown shirts brown tanks just i like brown, brown pants for wear dishes oh well that's different <laughs> so I got this big brown crew neck. It says Arizona on it. I've not been to Arizona, but thought it was cute. Um, definitely the big comfy vibe. And... Okay, I'll show you the denim that I got. So I always get jeans and stuff from the bins and sometimes it fits. Sometimes it doesn't. So it's really kind of hit or miss, but you just oh, gotta really keep buying to try them. So you can't try them on. Them, no, you can't. And I love mom jeans, which are High waisted or whatever you call it's them. It's jeans with a waist at the waist. Yes. <laughs> they call them high waisted now, but really it's not. It's just not low rise. But I got some with rips in them because I don't really have any that have like little rips. I don't know if the rips are there on purpose. They might just They're be cute. worn. But I thought they were so Those cute. the best kind of rips. Yeah, right? I the think they're really ones. just like real rips. Yeah. But the important part is that there's no rips in the bum. And it's a nice heavy denim. It is. Yeah. I mean, they're, oh yeah, they're Arizona jeans. That's which, that was JC Penny. Okay, I was going to say, Arizona jeans usually last pretty well. Mm -hmm. And then, also, these I don't know that are they're going to fit me. But I figured if they don't fit me, they'll fit one of my sisters. Um, I'm just a little concerned that they'll be tight. But they're just black mom jeans. Mm -hmm. um, and they are Riders by Lee. So. Nice. Entering yeah. the random part of my haul. I got this for Gabe. It's called, or not just for Gabe, but probably it will be Gabe. It's called Tiki Toss, the classic hook and ring game. And so you can see you hang it on like a tree or whatever, or, you know, on the deck, I don't know. And then you, there's a little screw screw hook that you put in it and it comes with rings. Those things are in here. And so it, this was attached, so it's new. It had never been used. So I thought vintage. that was cute, you know? Maybe, uh, sounds, seems like something he'd like. And it says for indoor and outdoor like use. He plays darts thing. in his room. It looks old, is that packaging so. old? Those look kind of older. Yeah. Older. Yeah. Cool. So yeah. So I got that. That was one of my random things. I got some plates because they're in a wrapper. And so we're just going to use these. We're talking. Who gets rid of paper plates? Like, can, huh? like just use it. Use yeah. the paper plate. Yeah. So I got that. And then I got this cutie little deer. 
It's so a flocked cute. deer. Adore. You know I love flocked deer. And uh, I thought it was really cute. So that was that. Did I show these? Did I show this? Yeah, I think. Uh... Did I? If I didn't show this, I got these. They're just these. You mini... showed me, so I can't yeah. Remember. These are the mini garden tools, and They're I thought so these cute. would make a really cute spring wreath. So, because you could just Very you know have a floral wreath or some kind of wreath, boxwood, whatever, and then attach these to the yeah. wreath. I thought that'd be really cute. So that's what that's for. So this I'm very excited about. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, it is reaching the end of the summer, especially in Minnesota. Oh, that's cute. But I got this little. You can see me right through. It's a beach cover up, so I wouldn't obviously wear this without a swimsuit that is under so it. Cute. But it's got little pom poms, and some of the pom poms kind of fall off, but it still looks cute with the little Adorable. like bordering after mm -hmm. it. So goes all the way down oh, I thought so that was really cute for like vacations and stuff mm -hmm. this again this is very like early 2000s mm -hmm. like Hannah Montana would wear this okay. shirt um I don't know what you wear under it I was too young to wear stuff like this I think yeah. when I was that age and it's pretty see-through so I don't really know what about like um I have that you could get you get them at Kohl's they're like these camisoles yeah and they're, they're a very thin fabric. Okay. I'll show it to you. Yeah. But I wear that under anything that okay. seems like a little too Yeah. Thin. But so I thought I'd get this because I just thought of Hannah really Montana cute. when I saw it. Thought it was kind of cute. Mm -hmm. Definitely back in style. And then my favorite purchase of the day. If, okay. Wait. I have to talk about this again because not everyone might know. Life is Good is like my brand. And anytime I'm at the bins, like if I find something Life is Good, like <clears> it has <throat> been a good bins day. Mm -hmm. And I'm usually really successful. Um, like every other time I find something life is good today. I did. I so think cute. this was done by that. Like, I don't think someone did this. It mm -hmm. looks like it came like that. Like yeah. a little like acid wash, which is very trendy right now, but it says life is good on it with the little flower. It's very cute. And of course it has the little, I can't remember what is his name, Johnny or something. His little face very on the back. Cute. It looks like someone probably cut it, but I really don't mind. I like cropped shirts, but cropped shirts so are so cute. And very then cute. it is a small, but It'll probably fit me like what do we call them a baby a baby tee. tee. Yeah, it'll probably fit kind of like a baby tee. I was telling her tee, about baby so. tees from back in the day. Yes. Mm -hmm. Very excited mm -hmm. about that. So yes. Okay, and a few more randoms. Uh, I got these. <laughs> this Sriracha is, sauce. This is a pack of new playing cards. I got them for the shop. Things like this sell like random yeah. stuff, and each card it is playing cards, and then they have recipes on them. Okay, so I got these things for Chris. So, you know, we collect, not we, he, he I usually find them, but he collects them. These little McDonald toys, mm -hmm. he does not have Black Panther, yes. and he does not have this one, I forget what he called, uh, Ant-Man, Ant-Man. I think that was Wasp. Really? I don't know. Either way, doesn't matter. It's um, Ant-Man and Wasp. So okay. That was Wasp. So, he does. He didn't have these two. I FaceTimed him from the bins, and he was like, oh my goodness, get those. So, he was very excited. And then I also got him this Transformer. Transformers. So it's we. He thinks it's from the Beast Wars, which was a show in the nineties or the early two thousands. It was early two thousands, I yeah. think. So cute. Um. So anyway, so got those for Chris. I got these sweatpants. Sweatpants are very much just what I wear. That's just the way of the world. They're more like. They're like running pants or something. Yeah, but I just wear them regularly, oh, okay. like sweats. But if you wear them with a little like cropped tank, it's pretty cute. They're just pants mm -hmm. they're very much like exercise pants. Squishy squishy pants. Yeah, yeah, they're yeah, squishy. yeah yeah so that's those um i got a pair of blue just like navy hanes sweatpants again they're actual sweatpants these are actual sweats just pretty standard and then i also got oh that's adorable this little so another thing that's really popular right now is crochet um like anything crochet tops Who skirts things like that so this I thought was so cute. I could definitely wear it with like a little tank under it, but that's kind of like the pattern on the back. We see that. So sorry, I hiccuped. Um, cute little crochet cardigan. I got this. It is a watercolor. I love it. It's a geranium. It's hard with those. Circles. Yeah. <laughs> um, and it's signed A M Holloway forty seven. Is what it says. Okay. So. Um, thought it was really cool, but then look, it's got like treasures back here. There's another yeah. painting here. So I'm going to carefully like cut into exacto this, knife exacto it. knife yeah. it and see what's behind there. Cause it looks like there's a lot of it stuff. It looks back like there. there's other treasures back yeah. there, but I got it originally cause I, I'm just going to hang this in my, I have a floral art wall going down the stairs. Yeah. So I'm going to hang this there. I haven't gotten a piece for a while. 
on that art wall. And I think this is really pretty. I have geraniums that look just like this on the front porch. She does. I watered so. them many times. Yeah. Okay. And then we each got a bag. You want to show yours first? Okay. So I got a coach mini purse. Amazing. It's got a pretty hefty stain on the back. So I might try and stain stick it, but if you I should just read on, on yeah, how to how get to, it out, to... but also I can just hold it like this and you don't yeah. even see it. So that doesn't really bother me, but the rest of it's in really good shape. Like the leather is still in really good shape. Yeah. It doesn't look like the inside like isn't stained. So I, yeah. they must've gotten one stain on it and we're like, Oh, uh, whatever. Yeah. But I thought it was super cute. Yeah. And then I got myself a new Vera Bradley bag. So I use a Vera Bradley purse that someone gave to me. Mm -hmm. You know who you are. Thank you very much. I use that every day. But, um, you know, Vera Bradley, they don't hold up super well, great. Because they're, they're fabric. Cloth. Yeah. Cloth. And uh, because I don't switch my purse, I wear through them really well. And this one's in really great shape. Um, there's not really much wear on it. It has a magnetic closure. Mm -hmm. And it's in really clean shape inside. So... I was really excited, and it has yeah. the tag to show that it's authentic Vera. Authentic. Oh. Should I show my last couple of things? Is that, are you done? I'm done, yeah. Show, show a okay. few more things. I'll show a few more things. Okay, so I'm only going to show you the things that I'm, like, excited about. Okay, actually, I have three things left. Uh, four. Great, because this is cute. So, again, 70s is also kind of in style. It's, like, this very weird like fusion right now of like 70s 90s retro fusion yeah it's very retro fusion like basically like anything that's old like stick it with some mom like you can yeah. figure it out like it's just like a very like weird time but i like it a lot because yeah. i can wear anything um and so this this is probably pretty new to be honest but it reminded me of like the 70s a little mm -hmm. bit because it's got like the kind of like bell and sleeves the poets, yeah, the and the, yeah. Sleeves or so i thought this was so cute oh stand up a little super cute oh, yeah, just totally flowy cute. and even like with these jeans like yeah, yeah. thought Very it would be cute. cute i like the big open bell sleeves next thing i was a little unsure about this but we decided it was an okay purchase got a pillow which i'm usually hesitant to get thrifted pillows because it grosses me out a little bit but you can take this off so you can mm -hmm. unzip it. So I will wash this. Mm -hmm. And then the inside pillow looked really clean. We looked for like, like we looked for like bugs, stains. Evidence of yeah. lights. And, and it like just that. looks, so. yeah, there's no like stains and it even, on yeah, it. It, it was like probably just on someone's couch for yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Like, like it's not like it was like, pillow. yeah, no one's ruled on it, you yeah, know? It so I just thought it'd be cute for my little futon mm -hmm. um, when I moved back to school. And the last thing I show, I will show you very into like picnics and outdoorsy things these days like everyone's all about the outdoors and so whenever we go on picnics and stuff we need blankets but i don't want to use my fuzzy like soft cozy blankets so blankets like this which if you know what a drug rug is is there a formal name for a drug rug <laughs> or is that it's just like what you those, call it i don't i never called it that but there is a oh, name we call for them, them drug rugs because like but it's like those big like, over sweatshirts made yeah they're very kind of like fabric. beachy like yeah. surfer dude kind of surfer chick you know what they're called so this is just a really big blanket that i thought was perfect for like outdoorsy things because it's a little rougher it's not super soft yeah it's great it's got the little like and you got a picnic on the blanket end. i did oh, yeah i got one similar to this that was like rainbow it's in one of our older videos and i use it all the time yeah, i yeah. just keep them in my car mm -hmm. so you always have them so if me and alec are just out we're like let's the just go hang out the boyfriend like let's go hang out at the park and so we yeah. lay down the blanket and you know we yeah. do our thing so yeah oh there's one Oh yeah, go for it. So the last thing I got, I always like to look for Gabe. Gabe has a very like thrifty style as he does. well. Um, very much like that like 80s, 90s kind of stuff. And so I thought this was so cool. He's definitely gonna like that. It's just like this is 80s, right? Or is yeah. it 90s? Yeah, Probably just 80s. totally 80s. Like it's got the little collar and it's not like separate shirts, like it's all just attached. 90s. Yeah, oh, yeah, whatever it is. I just thought it's a little big, but Gabe's He's pretty big. He's got he pretty is, broad yeah. shoulders. Mm -hmm. it, it was an extra large, but I thought it would be cool. And people wear oversized yeah, things yeah. all the time these days. Definitely. So it's got like this is like the waffle material. Sorry for my nails; they're not particularly cute. And then and it's got no like pit stains. Or yeah, anything, there's no so pit stains, nice. and it's just like the what is it called? The color patching, like mm -hmm. color blocking, color blocking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So mm -hmm. thought he would like that. He's not here right now. He's on a camping trip. But Gabe, With when you get boys. back. Yeah. This is for you. That's right. So, yeah. All right. So, that's all that we have for you today. Yes. That was our very large bins haul. So, between the two of us, on all of that, we spent $70. 70. Mm -hmm. Which was and good. Yeah. So, we'll yeah. see you in our next video. Bye. Bye.
Warlock from the movie? The live action movie? The Transformers one? Where he's discovering. He's figuring out the Transformer. I think, I mean, well, but he kind of looks like a dragon. I don't know. I'm going to have to look. All right. <laughs> really he's going to do know. some research. going to do some research. He's cool, though. Good, good. And here's your other two things, buddy. Yes. Okay, Mom thought that was, it's not Ant-Man, right? That's Wasp. This that is Ant -Man? Wasp. Oops, I was wrong. Right. I don't watch Marvel movies. No, I wasn't blaming you for being wrong. Yeah, I was yeah. just proud of myself that I was right. That is yeah. very good. Thank you. Wings. Thank you. Oh, cool. Wait, that's how it gave it away. And Ant Man's like red and gray. Oh. The color scheme, yeah, the yellow. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Cool. Very good. All right. Bye. This is the shirt. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. It's adorable. Very excited. This might be my favorite. My favorite Life is Good shirt that I've gotten. It's so cute. Because the other ones are like t shirts. This one's just very trendy. Yeah. So cute with her little mom jeans. Cute. Adorbs.